The owner of Film Bar wants other small businesses to look at the bigger picture. Now that they're getting over the shock of what's happened, he says it's time to take action. Kelly Obby says when the state put restrictions on restaurants and bars, he closed his doors and furloughed his seven employees. I mean, I was on my heels like everybody else and sort of saucer eyed where I was just sort of stunned for a few days. And preparing himself for financial ruin. And then last Thursday I woke up and something just hit me. I was like, it's time. Time to take a stand. His new motto, he's already had printed on these buttons. But you got to you got to scramble. You, this is, you know, it's it's any anybody who's ever started a business that knows what it's like to build something from the ground up. You sorry, time to do it all over again. He started sharing this positivity with other business owners like Don and Earl White at Fifth Avenue Cafe in Central Phoenix. We were sad. We were not our usual smiling self and he came in to order a burrito to go and started just telling us all the things he was doing. His advice, start working with vendors now to defer payments. Once you know your budget and cash flow, figure out a way to continue operating. Get creative, I mean, honestly. I was making lists. We decided we would do full takeout. We would continue our menu. Keep an eye on potential state and federal grants. If you need a handout, don't be afraid to ask. And, and, and embrace your vulnerability for a minute. It's actually worked. And and we've been so grateful. As many customers as I've taken phone numbers for, I've called and just said thank you. So one of the ways Film Bar is getting creative is by streaming the movies they normally show here online. You can go to their website for a full list. In downtown Phoenix, I'm Monica Garcia with Arizona's Family.